More details are emerging of the U.S. soldier accused of killing 16 civilians in Afghanistan, including a concussive head injury sustained in Iraq. The 38-year-old father of two, described as a decorated survivor of war wounds, was on his fourth deployment to the Middle East, and stress may have played a major role in the incident, according to his lawyer. He's never said anything um, uh, antagonistic about Muslims. He's never said anything antagonistic about uh, Middle Eastern individuals. Uh, he's, in general, been very mild-mannered. The Army Staff Sergeant's name hasn't been released by his lawyer or the military. He'd apparently also witnessed his friend's leg being blown off the day before the shooting. He was told that he was not going to be redeployed. Uh, and they were, the family was counting on him not being redeployed. Uh, and so he, he and the family were told that his tours uh, in the Middle East were over, and then literally overnight that changed. So I, I think that it would be fair to say that he and the family were not happy that he was going back. The soldier's lawyer also disputed allegations that alcohol and marital problems played a part in the incident. After 11 years of service, the soldier is now in Kuwait at a pre-trial confinement facility.